Good morning and welcome to another video uh, on a overcast Sunday. I'm starting the morning early, um, heading to the gym. I've got a special guest from the gym today. Good morning. I want to do my gym session quickly. It's a pretty big day in the Premier League. Uh, Liverpool, Manchester United. Do they know your obsession with Liverpool? So I am an avid Liverpool supporter. Um, big day, huge day. The result of today's uh, game can more or less determine my mood for A, the rest of the day, or B, the rest of the week. Yeah, I'm just hoping that uh, they, they get their act together and they go out and just play like they did in last season. So gym session all done, but uh, just walking back home, uh, I saw this, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see this, small colony of ants carrying this bee. <laughs> it's crazy. Maybe it is true what they say about ants carrying like a thousand times worth of their weight. That's pretty cool. Poor little bee. Good way to end a Monday. Woodford Reserve. Making an old fashioned here. So, oh, sugar everywhere. Teaspoon of sugar. Drop of boiling water. Just stir that around just to dissolve the sugar. Once the sugars are dissolved, some old fashioned bitters, about two dashes. And use a bit of old fashioned mix as well. Just a drop of that. Now, Woodford, double oaked. So good. And got some ice just to fill it up. Give it a quick shake. Most importantly, a prepared frosted glass of ice. Then we take one cocktail cherry. Drop that in there like that. Just like that. I like to take just a slice of lime, drop that in there as well, and some orange peel, give it a twist, so all oh, that zestiness pops out. And I'll just drop that in there. And that's it, old fashioned. Here at Consuelos Beach. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Pretty empty. Very rocky beach here. But it's nice though. So I'm gonna set up here. Ideally, I would have liked to have gotten the waves like from a side on view. There's some good breaks out over there. Try and frame it and see what kind of shot I can get. Okay, so not exactly the waves that I wanted or the waves that I thought were gonna be here today, but I still managed to get some good shots. So, that wasn't too bad. I got out and created a little bit. It's funny, you always take like, I don't know, 100 shots, and I'd say probably about five, maybe, will be good. All right, that's it. Time to go home, have some lunch, and then uh, have a look.
look what shots I got. A bit of an off day for me today. Uh, didn't really have a whole lot planned. Woke up, uh, went to the gym, caught the end of the inauguration for Joe Biden. That was pretty good. Uh, popped out to the shop just to get some bits and pieces. Came back and uh, I've jumped on to Warzone. Uh, I play with my buddies back home in Ireland the odd time, so I'll get on this for an hour or two. Uh, weather's been pretty bad today. Um, it's been raining non-stop today. Yeah, it's been pretty awful today and yesterday. Good morning. Jumping on a TikTok trend this morning and I'm gonna need this. This, this, and this. That's actually a lot better than I expected it to be. TikTok once again comes to the rescue. Uh, so now we're both headed to Mod Realty, a real estate agent on island, uh, to discuss with the developer on a new development up in West Bay that we're purchasing. Uh, we're gonna run through final finishes and upgrades and all that kind of stuff, so. Forward to that. Uh, got the haircut. I uh, got it really tight on the sides and back. You can probably notice that it's not as tanned as the rest of my skin. Hopefully tomorrow now the sun is out and uh, put a bit of color on that. But I have everything ready to rock for tomorrow. Got all the drone batteries charging, the smart controller charging, uh, batteries for the cameras charging. Just like anything really, when I'm traveling, have everything ready to rock and roll, fully charged, shoots as well. Memory cards are all cleared. Not bringing a lot tomorrow, just this camera, Osmo action, the drone, probably a tripod. And I think that, that should be it. I always tend to bring more than I need because I'm always thinking, oh, I'm, I'll use this or I'll need this or just in case. And rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. But nine times out of 10, I'll never need it. And I've just got then a bag that weighs 25 kilos. So I'm gonna try and pack light tomorrow because I kind of want to run and gun all of the stuff. But yeah, looking forward to it. So I guess we'll see you in the morning. Look at this bad boy. Isn't that pretty cool? What do you think of it? That's really cool. Yeah. All right, so we have this for the day. Headed to Tuca. Uh, I'm the last behind. They've all ran in quickly. Um, so far, the moke. It's it's cool. It's super fun. And the weather. We were great with the weather today. Right. Let's try and find where these these have gone. was fantastic. Highly recommend Tuka or Tucker. Tucker? Uh, Australian themed bar. Great. Now to get back into the smoke. The seats are gonna be hot. Who's getting in first? Not me. Bring it out. Yeah, you guys have long yeah. Oh man! That is hot. Wow. That is oh. very hot. Do we just have to embrace it? Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's <laughs> not. Can you sit in your water bottle for a bit? Oh, oh. Very hot. Oh, ah, yeah. Not great. 
But at least it's not raining and it's a beautiful day. Yeah, the car isn't wet. Going to Barefoot Beach now. Little walkway, a wall. Go down and get some views. It's gonna be lovely. And more than likely our final stop for today, Kaibo Yacht Club. I'm gonna sit down and we've had lunch obviously at Tuca, so we're just gonna get a refreshing drink and just relax for the afternoon. is a wrap for today. Uh, what a day it was, it was really fun. Did you enjoy it? Yes, so good. Yeah. I want to do it like every weekend. Yes, it was a cool little car. Definitely got to see some of the island that we haven't seen before, which is pretty cool, even though we've been up to Run Point plenty of times before. So I think we're gonna go home. I'm just gonna dust some of the sand out of it so it's kind of clean. And then we'll probably drop it up back to the airport later on tonight or tomorrow morning. But, Definitely uh, recommend. Yeah, I mean, if you're in Grand Cayman and you want something adventurous to do, definitely rent one of these mokes from Avis. It's cheap as well, I think it was like $120 for the day, so can't complain with that. Take one or two photos of the car, get the drone up, because the sunset is pretty amazing right now. I'll leave you with some more drone footage at the end of this video. Once again, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you, if you can, and I'll see you next week. Bye.